Hi Virgo, welcome to my third channel, my Virgo only channel. My name is Chelsea. In this reading, we're going to find out the person you're seeing, dating or talking lately. How do they feel about you right now? Today is the 25th of June, 2024. Time here in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia is 6.41 a.m. Virgo, I'm giving away free personal reading once a week for a lucky winner. To enter, hit like, subscribe, and comment below. I love Virgo. If you have commented before, you can do it again. It will increase your chance in winning. And winners will be announced on the community page weekly. All right, Virgo, let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me for Virgo. Currently seeing, dating, or talking to someone relatively new. Um, how do they feel about Virgo right now? And Virgo, this reading is for those of you not in a relationship with this person yet. <clears throat> it's a relatively new connection, okay? Let's see. Thanks for being here, Virgo. And please bear in mind that roles can be reversed. Roles can be reversed between you and your person. When I say relatively new, it means maybe one year and less. Okay. Page of Wands and one first. Somewhere relatively new. Okay, now the two of pentacles here feels like they are they are not sure, okay? Either they're not very sure about their feelings for you or that their feelings could be like it could be ever changing because if you look at the waves here it's going up and down and same goes to the two of pentacles it could mean also that they're still evaluating you weighing pros and cons you know still trying to figure you out we've got the six of pentacles in reverse how are we going to make this work this is how i'm what i'm sensing right now how are we supposed to make this work because eight of cups could mean that if if I was to, if me and Virgo were to continue this connection or take it to the next level, that means I might have to leave behind something, whatever it could be, whether you know it or not, okay? Page of Cups, your person could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Um, they do have romantic feelings for you, but Page is young, so it's in the like the beginning part of you know new new romantic feelings may not be like a whole lot but there is something there okay we've got the eight of swords in reverse nine of pentacles in reverse they may feel like okay hmm if they should put in more work into this connection not fully committed yet okay not fully committed yet but definitely thinking about that again could be weighing their options as well. Eight of Swords and one first five pentacles. So they could be analyzing things, wondering if this connection will be challenging. Unsure if it's gonna be challenging in the future. Queen of Cups and one first, they may feel like you are sensitive. The Queen of Cups and Reverse could be either like sensitive, insecure, if not. Um, they're not sure how you feel about them, um, if it's genuine, or if you even have like romantic feelings for them, if you even love them, okay? Wheel of Fortune is here. Wheel of Fortune is a major kind of, they may feel like, okay, things are going to have to change. It's a change that, now, I've, now the Wheel of Fortune I always talk about how the wheel, the wheel is always turning, right? It's always turning. It can go this way, this way, that way. So the feelings for you may be changing every now and then, okay? They may also feel lucky that they have met you or that there is a change of the dynamic of this connection where that they wonder if it's going to be challenging or not. Okay, let's see more for go. Could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, and then we've got the Tower here. Uh, Virgo, bear, bear in mind that this is a general reading, so if you prefer a personal reading that's tailor-made just for you and you alone, a lot of people tell me that I'm very accurate. All info is below. Could be a Leo, Strength. 
I feel like they need to tread very carefully and um, not really... I feel like they don't really want to rush, okay? The strength coding also indicate patience. Um, it's also like that feeling of let's go with the flow because there's a flow here, right? Page of Wands in love, in love verse. They're definitely holding back what they want to say to you. Um, it, I feel like it's too soon. That's what I'm picking up on. It's too soon to tell. It's too soon to express completely um, everything, how they feel, what they're thinking about you. Not a cup here, some of us. Now, the not a cup, some of us doesn't mean that they don't love you or that they don't care about you. I do see there are some feelings there, uh, but the page is here and the night is here. So that means one day, one day, maybe, they will evolve to becoming the Knight of Cups. Because the Knight of Cups is one level higher than the Page of Cups. We've got the Tower here. This part, I feel like, Virgo, is for those of you, if recently you and your person, if, say, something happened unexpectedly between the two of you, they may be, they may start to now reevaluate, right? What's going on, how they feel. There is also this awakening, this realization that, okay, something is going to change. Uh, for some of you, the changes could mean somebody is going to leave. When I say somebody, that means it could be you or the other person. Somebody might have to leave the country or travel or move. Um, and now it's making them, again, weighing the pros and cons if they should fully commit or not, okay. There is a change. The, uh, the world right here indicates them. They do feel you are attractive. They are, you're on their mind for sure. But see, again, the world is a major arcana, so there's something that is shifting a new chapter is beginning. It could mean that they're starting to feel something is changing or transforming in this connection. But it doesn't... And they're probably prepared for it and they're thinking about all, all sorts of possibilities because the Wheel of Fortune means anything can happen, right? And the Tower is also very unexpected. Unless it's also them feeling that Oh my gosh, I've caught feelings for Virgo. My feelings are changing for Virgo. And I don't know if it's good for me or not. Because this person, this new person may not want to fall in love that quickly or want to commit that quickly. They maybe didn't expect to feel this way for you. Maybe that wasn't their plan to begin with because the strength here is them also wanting to feel like strong, have control over their feelings. But the Knight of Cups in reverse could mean emotionally un uh, unstable as well. So I do uh, sense, Virgo, your person is somebody who likes to feel like they're in charge and they're in control of their feelings, right? But now that it's changing, and they may start to wonder what's going on because it hit them unexpectedly. It happened unexpectedly. It's almost that, that energy of like catching feelings, but oh my gosh, like kind of scared, kind of afraid to sort of fall too deep in love with you or starting to feel like they need to be committed or offer you a commitment, okay? The moon is in love first. Now, Virgo, they're starting to realize something about you. I feel like there are two groups of you, uh, Virgo. The first group of you, it's someone who feels like your person may be feeling like you are ever-changing, you're unpredictable, 
your feelings for them. They're not sure anymore how you feel about them. Because the dynamic of this connection has changed. It could be due to external factors, internal factors. Another group of you, Virgo, it could be them feeling like, oh, I didn't expect to feel something for Virgo. Not too comfortable about this feeling, which is like catching feelings for you, okay? Because they know that they need to walk away from something or someone, a situation, through once and one first, turning their back on, maybe it could be a certain lifestyle, or again, could be a person, third party situation. Now, third party may not always mean another person, it could mean external factors, internal factors, friends, family, anything, environment, um, a, some sort of a situation that could be coming between the two of you that they feel like they need to leave behind and turn their back on, and now they're really seriously evaluating that, okay? Virgo, this is your reading. Hope it serves you well. Um, don't forget to hit like, share, and subscribe. Subscribe anyways, it's free to subscribe. And especially if you've been here before and you find this reading to be useful, I post your videos every single day. I give you updated readings because things are ever-changing and feelings are ever-changing. We all know that. So you get updated reads from me every single day. So be sure to hit also on the bell notification button. So you'll be notified every time when I post your videos. And uh, Virgo, I have a main channel. It's called Chelsea Love Tarot. You can go ahead and check out my main channel. I normally would go live on my main channel uh, and do paid personal readings. There's no specific amount, um, no fixed price. It's whatever you can afford. It's my way of giving back. All right, Virgo, take care. I love you, and I hope to see you back here again soon. Bye.